One of the few questions that I will receive in my training is number one is that do you trade high impact news? The answer is yes, because if you don't trade that, then literally price is not really moving fast. We want fast movement, then we can have fast profit. Then the next question would be then when do you trade the news? Do you trade before it or do you trade after it? Now my answer to this question is it depends. It really depends on your strategy. Now why is that so? For example, uh, there are some people who are trading the breakout strategy and their trade would likely be after the news because then after the news is released then price move drastically whether there is a break or it doesn't have then you trade after the news but for my strategy which is to use the alien wash the key characteristic is that we sort of predict that turning point so when we want to sell we always manage to sell at the top and when we want to buy we always manage to buy at the bottom so for us we trade before the news that means before the data is released there are a few things is that you have to understand your strategy because for tor for example we are able to trade or rather to get a signal to trade right a few days before the news okay because we are using this technique which is called fake news right so usually what the market will do is that days before the actual data release they would stand by they would just you know, do some funny business along the key price level and that's where a lot of fake move will happen. So we do get our trades days or even week before the actual news. So for us, we trade before the news and days before the news. And what do we do when the data is released? Uh, that's where either moments before the data or after the data, depending on price movement, right? we will close the trade. Like for example, just now I was trading the Aussie employment data just about um, you know 40 minutes ago and that was in a profit. So before the data at 9.30 Singapore time, I had already partially closed and locked in my profit so when the data came out it was in my direction and subsequently I actually closed everything because price was very near to a support level in a way that if you ask me do i trade before the actual data release the answer is yes i do trade before the actual data release because i find that the market will be staging okay they'll be staging before the actual data release and it's usually a lot more profitable right to trade before the actual data but it really Really depends on your strategy as what I've explained just now. Understand more about your strategy, whether your strategy is more towards the uh, breakout trade, which the more likely to trade after the news, but if they aren't, then you will be looking to trade uh, like myself before the news for talk. So I'd like to demonstrate to you what I did for one of my trade, which is the Aussie trade that I just closed about 40 minutes ago. And to illustrate to you, you know, how I manage my trade before and after the news. This is all the employment change data that is going to happen in another seven minutes. So I had already a trade put in, two trades. One was a pound Aussie, the other one was Euro Aussie. And as well as I added one more, which was Euro Kiwi, but I already closed that earlier. These are trades which I closed before the release of the data. And these are trades which I closed after the Aussie employment data. For Tor, we are usually able to get a trade before the actual release of the data. So it's logical to take partial profit. That means to lock in some money into the pocket first before the data happens. For example, I have the Pound Aussie order here and I've shot it at the top. And since right now price is at the bottom and is near to a key Aussie data, employment data. So I could just shift the break even and also to close half of the orders. Okay, so I'm just going to shift that into break even because my entry price is about 1.9488. So I could just shift this into 80 to protect my profit. Right, and I would be choosing to keep my um, take profit empty here. Right, because I want to see how far it can go. Right, so that's uh, one way to do that. So not, now the position is into break even. Right, or the other way is to take half of the position. I'm just going to take half of this position. So instead of having two stand lots, right, I would just close one standard lot at the market to lock in the profit, and then the other one would be left into break even. Let's take a look at both my Aussie positions after the employment data for Aussie. 
and uh, they are both in nice in profit, right? And but price sort of like moves up. And since I'm trading the news, I'm trading before the news, and the news becomes an outcome, and the cat is out of the bag, I'll just close both positions, and they are both in the profit. Even if I want to live it on, I've already locked in half of my profit, and the remaining will be right now in a no loss situation, a break even situation. I'm happy about it. I could just see what happened later, like another 15 minutes to decide whether I should just close off this position. There's many ways that you can manage a trade. For me, it has been so far very profitable if I do it before the actual data because that's what my strategy is telling me. My strategy allows me to trade before the data. How about you? What are you doing? How are you managing your trades? Are you doing trades before the actual news release or data release? Do let me know, leave it in the comment. And if you like me to do other videos, let me know what you like me to do in terms of trade management, psychology, or even strategy. Let me know. And uh, you know, subscribe and like, and I see you in my next video. These are trades which are done by myself or my students using the Alien Wall strategy. Join our community and take advantage of our six times a week training lessons, automated trade signals, and live trading sessions with our experienced Alien traders. And for a limited time, we are offering a hundred percent full cashback offer on our course fee. That's right, you can learn our strategy risk free. Over 1,000 students have already taken advantage of this offer and seen success. Visit this website now to learn more and join our community.